Hello everyone, this is Chris with Mallet Pro Painting. Today we're gonna to talk about primers. What primers do you wanna use? Well, um, for in situations like with cabinets and stuff like that, when you're switching from uh, like a dark wood uh, color, it's recommended that you use a really good bonding primer and maybe with st some stain blocking properties. So in this case, uh, we did a, kind of a fairly large interior uh, office job and we used pretty much white. And we actually used actually the same color in all of them, actually. We used a low sheen for the walls, flat for the ceiling, and uh, satin for the trim. We used a different paint for the trim. And we used Benjamin Moore's Fresh Start Primer. And it's, uh, it's hard to see, it's called the High Hiding All-Purpose Interior Exterior primer so it's uh, supposed to give you that maximum hiding and it's a good bonding primer too that's kind of the biggest thing is making sure that the paint that we're going to use is going to bond uh, to the primer so you can't just use any old uh, primer like kills kills is a good product but that tends to be just more of a stain blocking primer not not probably the best bonding primer but it's good for stain blocking so as you can tell, just on one coat, you can kind of see all that tannin bleed coming through. And that's relatively normal. We already uh, you know, prepped the surfaces by scuff sanding it uh, so we can make sure that the primer adheres to it pretty well. And it's supposed to be like that. We are gonna go ahead and after this is done, we're gonna shoot, uh, spray the uh, top coat. Uh, we're using Benjamin Moore's Super Coat 500 paint. It's uh, more of a commercial product, but it seemed to go pretty good. It looks pretty nice. You can see that how it looked like on all the doors and trim here. So that's what we're working on today. Anyway, that's the tip for the day. Uh, have a wonderful day and happy painting.